Welcome back to Perks Recap, back at it again. It is time for part six of this uh, Grateful Dead concert reaction, this full concert reaction, three hours and 20 minutes. I'm enjoying it. We are starting set two. It is Shakedown Street. Hopefully you join me for the first five parts. If not, the links for those are in the description below. Um, but I just want to dive right in here. This is the beginning of set two. There was a break. They just, they just broke for set one. The last thing we heard, it said... We're going to take a short break. They come back, and there's a little bit of a, they, it takes them a little bit to get going. So I fast forwarded through that, and we're right at the start of the next song, which, like I said, is Shakedown Street. Please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Let's get started. Take down street, tremendous. I really like this song. I mean, it's got such a funky beat, and it's it's just a, a, another totally different sound from the band. And like I said in the last uh, the last part, this, they can do any kind of music. This is a completely different sounding kind of a song than everything they've done so far. Let's keep going. <laughs>
Oh, man. I'll go back 10 so we don't miss anything. I'm probably pressing my luck pausing it here because chances are it's going to be ending. You know, I'll probably resume and it'll end in like 30 seconds or something. But they really extended this out. This is what a great way to start the set off. A funky, funky shakedown street. So, so good. Um, the drums and the bass carry the song for me throughout the entire thing um, up to this point. But, you know, the last few minutes, though, Jerry has kind of taken over. And, of course, he's playing excellently, as expected. But, yeah, the drums and the bass, they really carry the song. The other version I listened to, same thing. It's just a really good song, and it's one of the highlights of, of the entire concert for me so far. Um, right up there with, the, you know, Little Red Rooster and Tennessee, Jed, Sugary. There's a bunch of them that I really, really have liked, and that's right up there with them. But I kind of expected that because this is just a really, really great song. The next song is called Lost Sailor. Don't, definitely don't know it, um, but I'm assuming we're going to have a normal pause before it starts. Let's see what we got. Let's see how much longer they extend, extend this out, because they have extended this out quite a, quite a bit. All right, we're going back 10. Here we go. <laughs> Send it out. Shakedown Street. Absolutely fantastic. Totally enjoyed that one. Like I said, the next song is Lost Sailor, and it should go right into Saint of Circumstance. I don't know either one of those. Uh, hopefully, I will be able to tell when Saint of Circumstance ends. The next song after that is Althea, but that one, these, like I said, Lost Sailor and Saint of Circumstance. Lost Sailor goes into it straight. There's no stopping. But then there should be a stop before Althea begins, and I should be able to tell then. So we're going to try to get both of these songs in, and then that'll, that'll be the end of this part. So let's uh, move on to Lost Sailor. <laughs> Hey, 
Where's the dog star? This is Bob. Jerry's guitar work, obviously, but I honestly think Bob, he's singing this. I'm assuming that's him singing. It's definitely not Jerry. Um, his voice sounds really good in this one. Like, this is probably the best I've heard. This might be the best I've heard Bob sing, period. I mean, it's that good. I'm really enjoying his vocals very much so. Um, real quick, well, last thing on Shakedown Street, I did want to mention for sure. That's the kind of song, I don't know how you listen to that and not move. That Shakedown Street gets you moving. There's no way you can listen to that and, and get into it and not and not sway or bob your head or just get off your feet and get moving because it's that kind of a song. It does that to you, and that did it to me for sure. And I didn't mention that before, and I want to make sure I got that in. Anyway, Lost Sailor, I think it might be wrapping up. Maybe, maybe not. And then we're going to go right into Saint of Circumstance, and that'll be the end of the, the uh, part here.
say that was Lost Sailor. Like I said, that could be Bob's best vocals that I've heard. The guitar work there. First of all, first of all, Phil on the bass, Shakedown Street and that song, the bass sounds absolutely phenomenal, these last two songs. It's amazing. Um, but once again, we have Jerry kind of off in his own world there. The song is playing. He's having this, this, this guitar work that he's doing. It's not really a solo, but it's kind of in the background, a little, little bit in the background. You kind of got to listen for it. But if you're listening to Jerry's playing, he's that. It's, it's just so cool. And I picked right up on it. But you do have to kind of listen for it a little bit. It is in there, and it was it was excellent. But again, it's not one of these up front, in your face, everybody else lays out when he's going off on a solo. It's not like that at all. Um, it's a typical kind of Jerry kind of a solo. And again, it fits the song perfectly. That's what he does. Okay, this is Saint of Circumstance, and that'll wrap up this part.
that one built up to a big crescendo, which I always like, and it really was a great payoff. Once again, Jerry caught my attention. Not a solo where everybody lays out for him, but he's going off on his own. And, of course, it still fits the song perfectly. That's what he does. Uh, but I, it caught me at my ear again. I was trying to point it out. Hopefully you were catching that, too. That was excellent. I got to say, these three parts, this is a you know one hell of a way to start off this set. I mean, this set is on fire right from the get-go. We'll have a quick close, and then we're going to get ready for part six. Seven, part seven. We're on part six now, part seven. There you have it, part six. Shakedown Street, Lost Sailor, Saint of Circumstance. I think one of the better parts or maybe the best part that we've done so far. This set of three, just, you know, they're starting out set two on fire. I really enjoy all three of these. Uh, Shakedown Street, can't help but move to it. Lost Sailor, you got Bob's best vocals in my opinion. And Saint of Circumstance had this big crescendo, this big buildup. Um, it was just a good, solid song. Jerry's guitar work caught my attention big time in that. Um, kind of, he had a couple of uh, times where the guitar work was stellar, but it was kind of in the background. You kind of got to listen for it. Typical Jerry, right? And um, the bass, Phil Lesh's, his bass really caught my attention on, on the whole, all three of them so far. So looking, really looking forward to the next one. That's going to be Althea. That'll be the start of part seven. Um, yeah, just really enjoyed part six. Like I said, one of my favorite ones. Real quick, all the information in the, in the uh, description below, all my other Grateful Dead reactions, plus all the other parts to this series we're doing, uh, all the previous parts we've already done, the ones that are coming up, you can be able to click right along and follow along. Definitely appreciate that if you do. Hopefully you join me for part seven. Um, also in the description, you got my social media information for Venmo and PayPal if you'd like to donate, and that is uh, definitely appreciated if you do. All right, that's going to wrap this one up. Let's move on to part seven. Please join me for that, and until then, I will see you later.